Shifting gears now to your forecast on your Wednesday. Here's Alexa. Well, our cold front has officially arrived, and since it is bringing us some drier air and windy conditions, we do have that weather impact alert day because there's a red flag warning in effect, meaning that there is heightened fire danger. It could happen, not saying it will. It's just conditions are kind of favorable that it would be it just behoove all of us to avoid any outdoor burning today. I know it's getting chilly outside, especially tonight. We'll want to have campfires and bonfires, but try to avoid doing that today since it's so dry and will stay breezy throughout much of today. Use that caution if you have an equipment that you use outside that can cause sparks pretty easily. Just to, today, I think tomorrow this will not be so much of an issue. I think our wind speeds will be calming down tomorrow quite a bit. But as for today, there is that red flag warning until 7 o'clock this evening because we have got the low humidity and the breezy conditions. There's also a gale warning still in effect until 3 o'clock today for the Gulf waters and for our lake. So it is rough out on the waters today. Not a day to be out there on the waters, but the cold front is bringing us some really delightful fall weather. It has been chilly this morning. It's been blustery. Temperatures are still in the 60s across the entire area. It was much colder to the north, and we're going to get a taste of that real chill, I think, tomorrow morning. So you'll want to bundle up tonight if you will be out and about, and especially tomorrow morning, you'll want to wear those jackets. 60s across the board, only 61 degrees in Macomb, 64 in Mandeville and in New Orleans. Same goes for Belle Chase, 67 in Laplace. Dew points are down in the 30s. It is not humid at all, and that will be the case today and tomorrow. It does stay windy today with those northeasterly winds coming in right now around 15 miles per hour sustained gusting over 20 miles per hour. So we've got those gusty winds above 20 miles per hour. That'll continue into the afternoon and even through this evening will stay breezy with sustained winds this evening, maybe up to 10 to 15 miles per hour. If you are heading to the Washington Parish Fair today, you do want to wear a jacket because we'll probably stay in the 60s all afternoon and it will be breezy and chilly as we head into the night tonight. So it is going to be beautiful though. Lots of sunshine, no rain to worry about. Really, the rest of the work week into the weekend, we stay dry. Lots of sun, beautiful days ahead, but we've got a couple chilly nights and mornings. Tomorrow morning is going to be the coldest morning. It is actually going to be cold. Low 40s north of the lake tomorrow morning, low 50s south of the lake tomorrow morning. So you'll definitely want the maybe heavier jackets, the long sleeves early tomorrow. Friday morning, also a chilly start to the day. Upper 40s north, mid to upper 50s south on Friday morning. Tomorrow, lots of sunshine again, a little less windy. There might be a little breeze here and there, but definitely not as windy as today. Temperatures tomorrow back around 70 degrees in the afternoon, and we stay in the 70s every afternoon through the rest of the work week, even through the weekend. So temperatures actually trend below average for the next several days. A little milder this weekend, 76, 78 for Saturday and Sunday. We will not return to the 80s until until early next week. So that's a lot to look forward to. Also, we're done with the humidity today and tomorrow. Friday through the weekend also will stay pleasant and comfortable. Don't have to worry about any mugginess. We really have a great stretch of weather. Also, the tropics are going to remain quiet when it comes to our part on the Gulf Coast. Nothing is expected to come into the Gulf Coast. There are a couple spots to watch in the Caribbean. The islands will have to watch for possible tropical development later this week, but it looks like nothing is going to come into the Gulf of Mexico over the next 10 days, which is great news. Here's our seven day forecast. Delightful stretch of fall weather today is going to be windy and cool. Temperatures may briefly hit 70 degrees for some of us. It's going to be cold tomorrow morning and Friday morning. Lots of sunshine over the next week. No rain. We gradually do get milder heading into the weekend and our nights and mornings won't be as chilly heading into the weekend and early next week and we'll be back in the 80s by next Monday.